Well, I'll be a son of a bitch. What is happening, guys? It is Monday night. I came here yesterday and worked on this song bitch for a few hours. You got most of the body work done on it. Again, guys, this isn't going to be a perfect car, okay? This is not uh, showing off talent by any means. It's a 2013 retired police car. Uh, there was a lot of damage on it. Found some dents in these quarters here and a little bit above that door handle. Uh, there was dents in the back door, the front door, this back bumper. You could see a little whoop whoop in there. Don't really care. The thing was ripped in half pretty much down there. Don't really care, all right? This, again, this is a driver. This back door had some pretty good damage to it. A little damage on that quarter. The bottom of the front door was biffed in pretty good. I didn't even see the bottom of the front door. Um, just because the car was kind of dirty and whatnot, and I started, you know, going down there with the DA with 320, and I'm like, man, what's going on down here? Fenders are lined up. You know, the hood still, it is what it is. All right, there's still a, you know, we got some little gap issues. Nothing severe, though. All right, let's stand back a touch. I peeled that frame horn back pretty damn close to where it belongs, so hopefully I'll have no problem putting a rebar on it. Uh, I already shot the front bumper. All right, I know it's probably not going to show up underneath this light, but you can see the metallic in it. It's a black, um, but it's I, I got a bunch of copper and stuff in it. I basically just took a bunch of dark grays, some copper, and a bunch of black and came up with this color. All right, it's got a little dirt in there, but, you know, what do you want? Not too bad of a color, though. So that's where we're at with it. I'm actually uh, going over it with a DA now, and... Um, you know, I'm just kind of knocking down this primer. I put some high build on. I know I should be blocking it. I'm not going to block sand this car, okay? Freaking, I'm not doing it. This car is like against all rules project. So, it's been basically using the DA. DA and everything down. Going to get her scuffed up. Uh, I got to put a little bit of primer up on the roof there, both sides where the light bar was, uh, which I'm going to do that now. I'm just going to throw some lacquer primer on it because it's a quick dry primer. And I'm going to shoot this son of a bitch tonight. That's that's the plan. So, yeah. Thought I'd give you a little bit of an update on it. Again, I don't know what I'm going to do with this front. I got have the mangled rebar still. I did straighten it out with a hammer. You know, kind of with a sledgehammer. It's not going to be right. I think I'm just going to bolt it back on there. I'm going to weld all the bracketry for the push bar that's over there. Right to the rebar and um, get that push bar straightened out, put a new piece in it, and be done with it. Uh, headlight will be here tomorrow, otherwise, the bumper would be on it. But with these cars, you gotta, you know, have the bumper off, change the headlights on them. So, well, that's where we're at with it. You know, it should look pretty good. You know, it looks black from a distance, but you get up close to it, it's got a little bit of a zing to it. A little more tape it on the windshield. Yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, I didn't take the charger emblem off it. Screw it. All right, it's me close enough to black where you really won't see all the little whatevers in between the letters. I really don't care. It's a driver. It's a 13 charger with 115,000 miles on it that was totaled. I mean, what do you want? I got this car five days ago. All right, and I've only been working on it nights, and uh, I worked on it half the day Sunday. So this has all happened, you know, after work hours, every minute of this. I think I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to be all right with it. Those mirrors, I, I was thinking about painting them body color, thinking about leaving them jet black. I don't know, I got overspray a primer on them. So guess what? I'm going to scuff them up. And they're going to be body color. If I don't like them body color, I'll paint them back to black. So, that's where we're at with it. Charger, charger. This push bumper, I beat it out a little bit with a hammer here in the center. And uh, I'm going to cut basically this whole piece off it here. Which we could do a lot of this on video. Cutting all this out with a plasma cutter. I'll make this right on the, uh, on the metal brake. I won't be able to get this curve in it. It'll be more of a 90, okay? But I could put a couple, maybe two or three 45s in there or something like that and give it a little bit of a texture or, or a curve to it, but with my brake, I don't have the dies to put in there to actually make these 
these bends. So it's probably, like I said, probably a couple 45s to make up that piece. And that's going to be where we're going to be with it. It's the old bumper cover off the car. I did manage to get this grill pretty straight. I think I might do a little video on this too. Um, let's see here. It's better. This thing was so freaking messed up. The grill was twisted. I don't know how it didn't break, but it did stress crack it here. Um, so is what I'm going to do is we're actually going to use some uh, rapid fix on it or an equivalent to that and uh, fix that. I'll show you guys how to do that. This is the lower grill. <clears throat> I'm going to try to make these uh, push bar brackets line up with what they already have cut out of there. That's the, going to be the attempt. The upper grills are smashed. I might just stick them in there though, why not? Glue them back together, do what I can do with them. At least there'll be something there instead of a big hole. They do have uh, cutouts for the push bar, but it's missing a bunch of that honeycomb. I might just take some stretch steel. I might just do that, take some stretch steel, put a piece of stretch steel behind a bumper cover. Why not? You know, let's break all the rest of the rules too. That's how we roll. All right, I'm gonna let you go. I'm gonna get this video uploaded, get the tunes jamming. It's tough, man. I gotta have music going when I'm doing this. <laughs> How you doing? I can't have music going when I'm on YouTube. They, you know, squawk. Copyright. All right, there's our little update. And, uh, we'll see you either in a little while or tomorrow with some paint on this bastard. Off.